everyone and welcome back to Art of the Cart. This is part two of the How to Draw People 101 series and today we're going to be learning about fleshing out the arm. If you didn't see the first video, I recommend going back and taking a peek at that video. It talks about building up the structure using a very simple stick figure. Hopefully you guys have done your homework and have been practicing drawing your stick figures and are feeling a little bit more comfortable with that. So now we're ready to begin to break the body down into different parts. We're going to start first with the arm. Now I'm drawing this on my computer so that you guys can see a little bit better but here you can see I just drew a basic structure of the stick person and I have in position but we want to add in some features to this so we're going to begin to flush it out because we don't want him to be that skinny so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to block this in just very simply I'm just going to use just parallel lines going straight down I'm not trying to make any kind of you know muscles or anything I just want to get the shape and you also want to think about you know what kind of person you're drawing. If you're drawing a female character, they're going to be a little more lean or not as muscular. If you're drawing a male, it's going to be a little bit more bulky and, you know, it's going to have a lot more muscle structure to it. So I have the shape kind of drawn out there. So now I'm just going to begin to then take away the hard edges because obviously we don't have that pointy of elbows. So now I'm going to start looking to see where I need to begin to taper in things. The first place I want to look to taper things in is at the wrist. The wrist is going to be much thinner. Whether you're drawing a boy or a girl, the wrist is going to be much thinner than the rest of the arm. As the forearm grows down towards the wrist, it's just going to slowly begin to taper in. Not drastically, you don't want to just like all of a sudden go shoom in, but just nice and slow. Also, we're going to go up towards the top where the arm meets the shoulder. There's a little bit of a muscle there, kind of a nice round, and then it goes down to the um, well, arm. Is that the bicep? But I think that's the bicep, tricep, forceps. I don't know. It's that second bump right there. So you have the thinned out forearm and a little bit of the shoulder muscle and then the actual arm muscle. But another thing you want to think about is the armpit. That'll help your arm to look a little bit more dimensional. It also will help you to begin to see some of the muscle, especially as we get more into drastic poses. So if you look right around here, you're going to see that this flap right here of muscle and tendons connects to your to your arm and then pulls over towards the front of the chest. So you're just going to want to indicate that with just a little line. Uh, the first arm I did was a female arm, so I'm going to show you this is the same arm drawn with more of a uh, masculine features. So you're going to see the muscles are much more pronounced. The wrist isn't so narrow. It's a little bit more of a, of a sturdy build, but still follows you know, the same thing. Now again, depending on whether you want to draw these um, cartoony or super realistic, the biggest thing I can tell you guys is just to look at real life and draw. Just draw, 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 draw all the time. Practice, practice, practice these out. I have just books of people, you know, magazines, whatever. Um, don't worry about drawing the whole figure. We're focusing on just fleshing out the arm. So just draw a ton of arms. Take pieces of paper and just fill the entire paper up with these floating arms. I mean, it's kind of weird. Don't worry about drawing the hands. Don't worry about drawing the rest of the body. If you want to, you can connect it to a stick figure kind of thing, but don't worry about anything else. Just draw arms and don't draw them all in the same position. Draw them in all different positions, different angles, looking from the side, looking from the front, looking from the back, arms raised, arms down, arms curled up in muscle man positions. Just have fun with that. So we've had our lesson. You guys have your homework. You're ready to go out. Draw, 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 draw. We'll be back again next week with another tutorial. So you'll have all week to practice that out. Next week I'll be back with part three of the How to Draw People 101 series. Um, so make sure that you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. I also have other videos coming out during the week. So have fun finding that. Have fun drawing your arms. And until next time, God bless you guys. And we'll see you later. Bye-bye.